wasn't so long that I was sitting in your seat. Um, and there's another thing that makes us very similar too, is that you're going out into a workplace environment similar to the workplace I went out whenever I graduated. Basically, the point is, is that it's a very different working world out there than it was when you just started in school here a few years ago. Smart crowd, I'm very impressed. Somebody's been teaching you right. I, was, I didn't have this class when I was in your seat, so uh, I don't know who's teaching you this stuff, but it's good. Yay! <laughs> what do I mean I don't know? I'm sorry, of course. Of course I know, excuse me here. So let's look at it. And you might fill this out as you go. 24% of people get their jobs from direct contact with employers. 23% get their jobs from alumni offices and recruiting firms. 5%. So tell your parents, who were the ones that would have been at my career expo thing in June, don't depend on the internet. Only 5% of job seekers get their jobs from responding to class classifieds, and that includes online. So the internet is not the, the, the magic pill that everybody thought it would be. 48% of people get their jobs from referrals, from friends or relatives. 48%, that's almost half of the people who are working got their job from a referral from a friend or relative. So let that sink in, because as we go through this today, that's where we're going to be focusing. We're going to be focusing on how do you make the most use of that method of getting your next job.